Hey everybody, Seth Gonzalez. I'm here at Cowboy Stadium in Arlington, Texas, ahead of this weekend's game between Texas A&M and Arkansas. Razorbacks watchlister Travis Swanson gearing up for the Aggies, and this is your Remington Report for Week 5 of the college football season. Start in Tempe, Arizona this week as Oregon State visits Arizona State. Last week, the running game was the difference for the Sun Devils and Garth Gerhardt's offensive line played a huge role this week. They've got an opportunity to go 4-1 and one and stay ahead of UCLA in the Pac-12 South. They'll face a hungry team in Grant Johnson and the Oregon State Beavers still searching for a W. Oregon State head coach Mike Riley talked about what kind of offense he'll expect from the Sun Devils this weekend. They, like other spread teams, they get, they really use the field. They force a lot of one-on-one -on -one tackling out there on the perimeter. But the style in which they do it is unique to them, and, and uh, they started it a year and looks very confident in it. And then uh, the, the other part of it is they'll, they'll just reach back and throw the ball down the field so well with Osweiler and the, and the guys making the plays down the field. So the combination of how they do it and, and the fact that they do spread you out like other spread teams do is, is – uh, it's a pretty good formula for them. We went to Morgantown last week. We go back again as Bowling Green visits West Virginia. Ben Boyacic and the Falcons also have a chance to get a winning streak going. Get to 4-1 and one this weekend. Falcons leading the MAC in total offense. Mountaineers, though, they'll be a dangerous team looking for redemption this weekend after dropping last week's game to LSU. Marquee game of the week is up in Madison as Nebraska opens up Big Ten play against Wisconsin. Mike Caputo and his O-line begin their toughest part of the schedule, their rushing offense, leading the Big Ten, and they'll have to keep it that way going against a difficult Badgers defense on the other side. Peter Kahn's a big reason for the success of quarterback Russell Wilson, his line protecting him well, allowing Wilson to pass for over 1,100 yards already this season. Don't forget this Saturday, Texas A&M and Arkansas game time is 12 Eastern, 11 Central on ESPN. Check your local listings, and if you want more games of the week, you can check out our blog. That's RemingtonTrophyBlog.com, RemingtonTrophyBlog.com.